Hey, we're very excited. On the line right now, our special guest uh, for Fan Fest happening on March 11th is the wonderful Jordan Ice. <laughs> Come on, in. Jordan. Yo. How you Yo. doing? Hello, hello. I'm hello. good. I'm good. Hey, we're looking doing? forward to you coming to Fan Fest. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, and, and you've Thank got a you brand for, new song. For, for oh, me. you're welcome. We just you know we love you. What else are you possibly doing? <laughs> I, I, I got to tell you that Chum FM has been humongous supporters for the new kids and and, and individually so I, I just can't thank you guys enough well we, it's likewise we appreciate everything you do for us and, yeah. and, and you guys are a bit, a bit of a role you guys are touring again this summer as the band in concert at the ACC June 8th and 9th yeah it just doesn't it, stop it doesn't I, I it's it's a fairy tale I, I, I can't believe it um, I, I, I was telling somebody earlier that you know we 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 started out and we we wanted to do ten or fifteen shows maybe for our really hardcore fans and yeah. and it turned into just this big you know big big thing like tour after tour after tour and uh, it's just been amazing. You know I remember talking to you about that in Barbados last year when you joined us and it was really interesting because uh, you know when we were interviewing you I was getting emails from all over the world and I'm thinking they think they're only going to have a couple of concerts are they crazy and then there was one show that was announced in Toronto and then the second show was added and then of course you guys appeared on is it the American Music Awards that I saw you? The American Music Awards. Yeah. You guys were outstanding. Like it was so it was so great to see that happening. So you are as Darren says on a roll. That's fantastic. Yeah, man. And uh Toronto was uh the first the first two or three shows that we did for our reunion tour. Yeah. So and and the, the first show we did was in Toronto and um when we came up on that riser with the music going, the fans were just going nuts and <laughs> Boy, was I scared. Were you scared? I was, well, I, I was scared, excited. I mean, it was just... <laughs> it's, it is it is amazing so... that after all these years, the love that's still yeah. there, and that you can come into a market like this and siphon that much money back out of it because the fans are still there. <laughs> I think it's got to be a, a big high. Yeah. It's a high. It, it The money's nice. It's not all about the money, yet, you know, as yeah. you know. Uh, oh, I you didn't know, know that. <laughs> yeah. We, we, just love, we just love singing and performing, and... Um, and the fans give us so much love. We just want to, you know, we just want to give it back. Listen, Jordan, I know you, I know your life has changed a lot over the years. Uh, isn't you've got two kids, Dante, right? Dante and Dante Eric. And Eric yeah. Dante and Eric. And if I'm not mistaken, Dante will probably be 11 later on this year. He's 11 now. He's and 11. Uh, so he's Eric just 12. turned four. Wow. Oh, boy. So Dante is is a year younger than you were when you joined New Kids on the Block. <laughs> Practically, I was uh, 14. Oh, you're 14. Okay, well, don't yeah. ask me about math. Okay, so if 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 Dante says I'm going to join a boy band in the next couple of years, would that just freak you out? Um, it would probably freak me out, and I would probably be, I might tell him, well, you might want to think that over. But uh, I think you know, I've been through it, so who, yeah. who better than but, to manage yeah, him some or, guy, or he'll have watch guidance. over him? But yeah. you must look at your own kid and go, wow, you're just you're not prepared for that. You're you're a baby. You're only 12 years old, but yet there uh, you were. Yeah, uh, uh, Dante is one actually one year younger than Joe was when he joined the group. Yeah, crazy. So that now that you say that, that's pretty mind-boggling. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, I just wanted to boggle your mind a little bit. Tell us about the new <laughs> single. We're going to play the brand new single here. The single's called "Let's Go Higher." Um, it's just uh, an up-tempo, you know, pop kind of anthemy kind of song, and it's just uh, it just makes you want to dance, man. Does it make us want to dance, man? That's right. Okay, well, we're going to see about that. We're going to play it right now. We want to thank you for being with us, and we're going to talk to you again on March 11th when you're here for Fan Fest. You got it. All right. Can't wait to see you guys. Good Thanks, luck. Jordan. Hey, great talking to Jordan. Let's go higher. His brand-new single debuts on Chum FM.